morning. Welcome to my channel. My name is Bobby. I want to talk about power, personal power, talk about magic. I want to talk about how do you get in it? How do you avoid toxic behavior with others? Here's the thing. A lot of people have the ability, but they're so fucked with by other human beings. The toxic nature of other people to the point where it's like you're just, you're deluded to the point where you can't, it's almost, it's hard to find a good analogy but it's like you know you can do the drowning man thing they're they're going under and they and you're trying to you don't you love them so you're there with them and they're drowning you too and you're going down kid because you're not going to get in your power if you're constantly surrounded by toxic human beings that aren't fixed aren't going to be fixed don't even realize they're toxic they're just running on what the fuck ever right survival hate you know but yeah but when you're in your power, it's it's, and I've noticed that like the last couple of days, phasing in and out, and not like in a bad way. For me, it's good because when I'm alone and I'm you know, and I am protecting my power and my angels are protecting me, I'm I'm in it. Nature loves me. I'm surrounded. I was getting. I showed up at, at Depot Bay, at Boiler Bay, in like. Like literally two minutes after I show up, I open my door and I'm sitting there and I'm like, hmm, whales. And I look over and a whale just like, Psh, and that was it. And I was in there watching whales for an hour. And then that ferret I was talking about, this little, it's a weasel. It looks like a, yeah, it's like this big. It was the cutest fucking thing I talked about in the past video. And I was thinking about it. I'm sitting there just, you know, doing my little zen thing, looking out at the ocean. And I'm just thinking about that ferret. I'm like, man, that was really interesting, right? Next, you know. Two minutes later, the fucking thing shows up, and it's just hanging out, looking at me, and it kind of squirreled away, and I was like trying to feed it some stuff, like I fed it some bread, and it didn't like the bread, so I was trying to feed it something else, and it took off, but yeah, so that was interesting, so when you're in nature, it, it blesses you, and God, this guy's got a loud motorcycle, hopefully it's not interrupting the video, but anyway, toxic people surrounded me. And that's kind of what it is. That right there would be considered a toxic interruption. But anyway, so the point being, to get into your power, you have to get away from people. I'm already in my power, so I'm cool. I can be surrounded by assholes. I'm cool. I can transmute it. But the point is, is when you're not in your power and you're going through the dark night, you need to be out in nature. You need to be sitting in the park. You need to be sitting by the ocean, by you know anywhere in the desert where you don't have to hear people. Trust me, you need to be isolated for even if for a minute. I know it's a scary thought for it, especially for women. But if you're going through it, you're gonna have to you're gonna have to accept the fact that these are lessons you're gonna have to learn. And you're gonna have to learn to control your emotion. And you're gonna have to learn to ha transmute negative energy to other people. And the easiest way to do it is is to show affirmations for your life. Thank you, I love you to the universe and God. Just say thank you for my everything I have. If you have anything, if you ate that day, you'd be thankful for it. If you have a car to drive around in, you'd be thankful for it. If you have somebody that loves you and gives you attention and affection, be thankful for that. And if they ain't the one, then go find the one. And be thankful for that, right? Be thankful. And, and it, what it does is it changes the balance. If you're always thinking negative and being all upset and sad, then that's just tipping it to the dark, right? So you got to, I mean, it sucks, right? But sometimes you got to make yourself happy. Think happy thoughts, say fuck it. They're not they're not winning today. Not today, Satan. You know what I mean? Just do it. Think happy thoughts. Go out and say something nice to somebody. Feed somebody else something positive and then maybe they'll you know what I mean? Pay it forward with, with positivity. Cheesy as hell, right? I don't care. I'm not gonna give up. I'm stubborn as fuck and I'm gonna fight with love and light. That rhymed. Cool. Anyway, I'm gonna let you go on that note. Yeah, have a wonderful day. I'm going to hang out and go for a walk on the beach. And then I'm going to try to do some more painting. And I'm really jazzed. I got about six, seven paintings I haven't posted that I'm really jazzed about. But U2 is not helping me on that one. Come on, U2. Quit blocking my shorts, dude. <laughs> I think I giggle every time. But the point is, when I post a short, like a video, less than a minute, it has a little tag in the bottom corner. It's a red little thing saying it's a short. I'm posting my shorts now. And there's no little red tag. And they're not showing up when I go check out my shorts. Man, I gotta think of something else. But the, my, my, the videos that aren't as long, I'm checking on those and it doesn't show up on there. So they're really shadow banning me. If anybody sees this, it'll be a miracle. It's just the one person that's apparently monitoring my, my 
channel. Fucking Nazis, anyway. With that, love and light. They're not going to win. I'm just too fucking stubborn. Come on now. I'm the Emperor of the Universe, and I'm Taurus. And I'm Aries in the Vedic, so I'm on fire, bitch. Not you, but, you know. Anyway, I love you. And I love you more than I loved you yesterday. Anyway, I know that's stupid. But um, God loves you too, and so does the universe, and we're, we're rooting for you. So get in your power and rock it. And I'm going to let you go. And go have a walk on the beach. Goodbye. Okay,